Mm. You used to have fun at the clubs. Mm. Some people still having fun at the clubs. Yeah. <laughs> oh yeah. Some people come to church wearing what they had at the club last night. Oh, that's a fact, people. Come on now. You know how it go. You woke up over somebody else's house. You don't have time to go home and change, take a shower, or anything. Amen. Hey, man. You was having too much of fun last night. But then you feel guilty. Uh -oh. oh, I better go to church. Yeah. Yeah, because you know what you did. Right. Yeah. That's right. See, what we do should cause us to feel guilty. That's right. If we're not doing what God told us to do, we should feel some type of way. Yes. Amen? Amen. You don't have to worry about it because if you're a child of God, and that's an if. <laughs> See, if you are a child of God, you should feel some type of guilt hmm. when you do wrong. Yeah. Amen. Okay? When you sin. Mm -hmm. Sin is simply all wrong doing. So don't be confused about what sin is. That's what it is. All wrong doing. And we all know if we're doing wrong if we sit up under the Lord. Okay? And if you sit up under the word of God, you will be convicted. Even if you think you don't do nothing. There's going to be something that you are going to come across in the word of God that will show you that you are guilty of something. Amen. Mm -hmm. Amen. Amen. Even me. Okay. I don't care who you are. Amen. I encourage you all the time to don't hold me up there. Mm -hmm. yeah. Okay. Yes, I need help. Yes, Amen. Amen. Yeah. Amen. In order for me to be right and to stay straight, yeah. I have somebody I depend on. Yeah. I have somebody I have to go to. I have to be in front of somebody 24 hours a day. Amen. Why? Because he sees and he knows everything. Amen. Amen. I'm not going to get away with nothing. No, sir. No, sir. That's why I always tell you guys repent. Yeah, I do. Amen. Just repent. Amen. Hey man, you're not going to remember everything that you need to be repenting for, but you know you need to repent. Mm -hmm. Amen. And when you remember those things that you did yesterday, a couple of hours ago, a couple of minutes ago, and you know it was wrong and you're repenting, look, just because you don't remember what you didn't repent of last year, you can still do it today. Amen. 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 Lord, whatever it was I did last year, because I know I was living a little fight. Amen. And I was doing a lot of things that, you know, just doing my thing. See, when we do our thing, we get in trouble. Yeah, yeah. yeah. that's right. Yeah, yeah. When we're doing our thing. That's why it's important to do God's thing. Come on now. Amen. Amen. Yeah. Now, I just want you to put that in your purse and your wallets and, you know, put them little nuggets I just gave you. Just stash them away. Amen. Amen. But the message tonight, I'm still on willing. Yes, sir. Okay? I'm still dealing with willing because our minds have to be willing to do what God called us to do. Amen. Amen. Yeah. Amen. Our minds have to change. Hmm. Amen. That's why the scriptures say if there first be a willing mind, yes, okay, yeah. you ain't even got to bring them to the table. Yes, sir. Yeah. Amen. God says, hey, if there first be a willing mind, yes, it's according, it's it's, it's according to what you have right now. So if your mind is messed up, bring it. Mm. Yeah. If your life is full of messed up stuff, bring it. Messed up. Yeah. Because God is just saying, bring it. See, when you bring something to somebody, that means you was willing to do it. Yeah. If I call somebody, hey, you know what? I'm giving this little party. I need you to make a cake. Can you bring me one? Uh, yeah. Yeah. You can say no, right? Right. Right. 
But if you bring it, you are willing to bring it. Amen. 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 Yes, sir. Yeah, so right. The same principles it is with God. If it first be a willing mind. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's according to what you have. So whatever you have right now, that's what God wants. Amen. If you broke, guess what? God wants your broke self. Amen. If you got a whole bunch of money, bring your money. Amen. Now I didn't say give the money to the church. Right. Amen. Because see, I don't want you to get confused. So just in case there's somebody up in here holding on to some big money. Yeah. Right. Amen. I'm not a money preacher. Yeah. Amen. Amen. But if the offering basket be heavy every now and then, that's that's beautiful. Amen. That's beautiful. Hey man, I'm not gonna be in your pockets. I'm not gonna be watching how much you dropping in. That ain't my place. Amen? Amen. Amen. As a man purpose in his heart, so let him give. Yes, sir. Not grudgingly, nor out of necessity. Yes, sir. Amen. Because God loved it. A cheerful mm. giver. Love it. A cheerful giver. Amen. So don't be believing in them people talking about, oh, you need to give this, you need to give this. Dig a little deeper and give me more. God. That ain't the God that I serve. Amen. Hey Amen. That's a different God than that's in the book. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. You talking about what a man's purpose is now. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Amen. Okay. okay. Our purpose is we want more because we greedy. Yeah. Amen. Amen. Yeah. You ever get a good piece of uh, cake or pie or, or whatever? Oh, one piece ain't good enough. Amen. 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 <laughs> one piece of some good pastries or pies or cakes for me is not good enough. Amen. Once I find out it's good, I gotta take some home. <laughs> Amen. That's just that's just how it goes. Amen. Amen. Praise God. So now let's get back to the business at hand. We're looking at willing, so I just wanna remind us, okay, the first one that we did was willing to change. Amen. We had to be willing to change. Amen. You have to be willing to change. If you want your life to get better, if you want a relationship with God, then you have to change. Yes. God don't have to. We Amen. do. Yeah. Amen. Amen. So then the next one was willing to do. Yes, sir. We have to be willing to do so change will happen. Amen. 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 Yeah. Amen. Yes, sir. Now tonight I want to be looking at this. Because I know that there's a lot of people in the body of Christ, but uh, does anybody in the right here know any nasty men and women of God? Mm. Yeah. 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 Okay. If you don't, just look a little harder. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. And listen a little bit more. Because I come to find out there's a lot of nasty people Okay, in the body of Christ. I don't care who believes me or not, I'm just going by my own survey. <laughs> Amen? And I trust my survey. Amen. Because I wasn't looking for it, it just hit. It just pops up. Amen. If you will listen to people. Okay, and listen how they talk, listen how they act. You know, if somebody's acting or talking different than they do on Sunday, oh, some, it's a problem. Yeah, yeah. Yep. It really is. It's, yeah. it's, it's a problem someplace. Mm -hmm. You know? Right. Mm -hmm. So that's not a good person, right? Mm -hmm. So tonight I just want to open our eyes to, you know, willing to do good. Mm -hmm. Amen. Willing to do. You know, doing good for a lot of us, we have to make ourselves be good. Amen? Amen. Just like you know when you was kids, you mess up the house and all of a sudden you look, oh, mama be home in a little while. Amen. You ain't been good since mama been gone, but now you look and you got 15 minutes. You know mama's coming. And y'all done messed up the house. Come on, we gotta clean up. You know mama gonna be coming home and you know if you, if you, you better come help me. If you don't, I'm gonna tell mama you broke that. Yep. Now y'all want to get busy. So when mama come home, she look and, ain't, and there's nothing messed up out of place. Oh, y'all being good. Right, right. Mm. Hmm. Amen. 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 
See, God wants us to be willing to do good. Okay. Amen. Okay. It's the difference between trying to be good and do good. Yeah. Mm. See, because see, you can act like you're good all you want to. But if you really are good, then good will come out of you. That's right. Okay? Good will come out of you. Good started with God. What God did, he just put another O in there. Y'all need to pay attention to what I'm saying. Pay attention. Amen. G-O-D spells what? God. All right. God just put another O in there, and it says what? Good. Thank you. I'm with you. Man. Yep. I love you, Lord. Yeah. Amen. Amen. And then some people today say what? Good God. Yeah. <laughs> you know, it's a lovely thing to talk about God. Yes, Amen. Okay? Because some places you go to, you can't hear nothing good about God. Hey, yeah. man, you hear about a lot of worldly stuff, and you go through what you need to go through, and all this kind of stuff like that. But I'm going to tell you something. It's all about God. Yeah. Amen. Amen. And when you get personal with God, it's all about Jesus. That's, right, Jesus. That's the bottom line. Yeah. See, we all talk about, yeah, I want to go to heaven. <laughs> ain't no heaven happening without Christ. Amen. Amen. Okay? And ain't nothing happening without God. Amen. Amen. So we need to wise up. So we're looking at willing to do good. Right. I want us to go to the book of Hebrews. Amen. Hebrews chapter 13. While you're going there, I just want to pray. Dear Heavenly Father, we come before you, Almighty God, seeking you, your wisdom and your knowledge. Heavenly Father, we just ask that you would teach us your ways, anoint our ears to hear the truth, anoint our hearts to accept your truth. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. 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 Book of Hebrews. You know, Hebrews is a good book if you've never been there. If you've never been there, Hebrews is a good book. So I would encourage everybody to get into the book of Hebrews and see what God has for you. Amen. amen. Say amen if we all there. Amen. amen. Hebrews. <laughs> Hebrews 13. Verse 16. Willing to do good. Are you willing to do good? Yes, sir. How many of us feel like it's necessary? It's necessary. See, it's a, half of y'all say, yeah, raise your hand. Half of y'all don't do nothing. Amen? But see, when you want something done, yeah. Okay. Yes, sir. When you want something, when you desire God to do something for yes, you, sir. Yes, sir. you hope God is good to you. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. So you need to practice being good. Amen. Yeah. You, you know what? God don't work like this, and I'm glad he doesn't. God doesn't wait for us to do what we're supposed to do before he does Amen. something for yes, us. Amen. That's what I love about it. Yes, yeah, yeah. That's part of that. That's true. Okay, because a lot of us up in here right now should have been gone. Amen. Amen. I don't know everybody's history, but I know a lot of history. Amen. Amen. But by the grace and the goodness of God, we're still here. Amen. We're still here. See, a lot of people don't understand that. See, we don't understand that until we go and we see somebody who we love laying hmm. on their back. Yeah. Yeah. Then you want to act all sorrowful and you want to do all these things like that. Right. Amen. How you living before that situation? Ooh, that's right there. See, that's what we got. We got to examine. The Bible tells us to examine ourselves to see where we are in the faith. Amen. If you love me, keep my, keep my commandments. My commandments. And if we are children of God, how do you think you can call yourself a child of God if it wasn't for God? Amen. Amen. 
Amen. Amen. God was so good to you. Huh. Yes, he, he allowed you yes, he to be his child. Thank you, Lord. Amen. Amen. Yeah. Yes, sir. Thank you, Lord. Let's do it. See, that's how good he is. See, what we do is we live our lives and we forget all about the goodness of God. Right. We forget all about the grace of God. Right. We forget all about that God is holy. And in spite of our unholy self, yeah. he loves us. Wow. Yes, he yes. 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 In spite of whatever you did, he loves you anyway. Hallelujah. Don't you know that's a blessing? Yes, Don't you know you can't get, no human being will love you more than God. Amen. 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 It's just not going to happen. That's right. Amen. Amen. It's not going to happen. That's right. hmm. And if you don't believe me, get in the Word. <laughs> See, the reason why a, a person can't say amen when they hear the truth is because they don't know what truth is. Okay. Uh-oh. Yeah. Yeah. That's you got to know what truth is before you can say amen. Uh-huh. Yes, sir. You know, just like when somebody be telling you something that happened to them, yeah. you really don't know if it's the truth or not because you wasn't there. Mm. Amen. Right. Yeah. Amen. But, you know, we find ourselves listening intently. Yeah. And then it sounds so good to us like it's the truth. We tell somebody else. Ooh, yeah. yeah. We tell somebody else yeah. what they told us. Yeah. Uh-huh. Amen. And it don't have to be the truth, but we just take it as truth. Yeah, huh. And we won't do that when it comes down to the real truth. Oh. The word of God is telling you the truth. Why don't you tell that? Come on now. Amen. 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 Run and tell this right here. Amen. 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 Mm-hmm. I like politics, but I love the truth. Amen. Amen. You heard what I said, didn't you? Yes. Yeah. I like politics. Uh, <laughs> but I love the truth. I love God. I love the word of God because the word of God tells you about them politicians. Amen. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Amen. Amen. <laughs> Willing yeah. to yeah. do good. good. Okay, are we there, Hebrews 13? Yes. Yes. Looking at the uh, 16th verse. Yes. It says, But to do good and to communicate, forget not. For with such sacrifices, God is well pleased. Yes, yes. Don't you want God to be happy with you? Amen. See, see, I don't want to fall into the hands of an angry God. Mm. Amen. I don't want that. I don't want God to be mad at me. Amen. Because I know what he can do. Amen. And I already know my life is just like a vapor. Here today, gone tomorrow. That's right. Amen. So I don't want God to be mad at little old me. Amen. 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 Yeah. That I don't want. That's right. So I want to be pleasing to God. Yeah. I want to make God happy. Amen. 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 I want to do good. How can you make God happy with your life? Do good. Huh. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Do good and serve him. Amen. Yeah. Even if you don't know how to serve him, you know how good God is. God will show you Amen. how Hallelujah. to serve him. Amen. 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 So you won't have no excuse. Yes, sir. Amen. He'll tell you what to do in his word. Yes, sir. Amen. 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 One of the main things is, hey, hide his word in your heart. Yes, Amen. Amen. That's that. Amen. Amen. So that you might not sin against him. Amen. I'm going to say this and go on. How many sinners we got in here tonight? Yeah. Okay, and I'm gonna put that. I'm gonna put that tail in on it because I know how some people say, "Oh no, ain't me, oh, ain't yeah, me." Yeah. That is not me. And when you say that, you lie. Yeah, so it is you. <laughs> okay, because we all fall short of the glory of God. Amen. Everybody in here, if you went anywhere, say, "How many sinners up in here? Every hand should go up." Amen. Yeah. yeah. Amen. Amen. You can go over there where the priest hang out. Right. You, you hear what I'm saying? Yeah. You can go over there where they all hang out and they all doing what they do and stuff like that. And you say that all of them need to raise their hand. Right. Amen. 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 Because none of us, okay, 
None of us are without blemish. Mm -hmm. Only one. And he went to the cross. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Lord. They thought they killed him. Uh -huh. Okay? They thought they killed him. They thought it was a dead man just like hanging come there. On, come on. They thought it was a dead man that they took to the tomb. Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. Amen. But God is so good. Hallelujah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Remember, I'm talking about this good stuff. Yeah, yeah, God yeah. is so good. Yeah. He loved us so much, he was still working while the body was dead. Come on now. Yeah. Yeah. about everything. Let's say he paid the price, yeah. but you need to find out what that price was. Yeah. What did he really pay? Yeah. And what happened to him? You know what I'm saying? Not just on the cross, but after the fact. Yeah. yeah. So you can really see how special you are. Glory, hallelujah. We are special. Thank you, Lord. Because a good God made us special. The angels ain't got nothing on you. No, sir. Amen. Amen. Come on now. A lot of people be, some people even pray to angels. I don't know how that happens. But some people do. Yeah. They pray to the angels. Some people pray to the saints. Wow. Saints can't help me. Amen. The angels can't help me. Not like that. Okay? I need God. Now, because the angels do what God say. Amen. Amen. And if God, and if God told three of them to come. And make sure they look out for me. Yes, that's what they gonna do. Yes, they gonna come and they gonna be on their post. Amen. Yes, sir. Yes, and wherever sir. I go, even if I get a little off track, yeah. huh. they gonna still be right Amen. there with me, protecting me. Amen. Amen. Because that's what they were called to do. Amen. Right. Amen. Yes, and they gonna watch over Pastor yes, Williams. Amen. 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 That's just the bottom line. If you yeah. know the word, then you know what I'm talking about. That's true. That's true. Amen. 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 Some people have one. Some people got two or three. Yeah. Mm. Amen. True. Amen. Because yeah. God just tell them go. That's right. And they, they gone. Mm -hmm. Amen. They gone. <laughs> yeah. They might not even have to fly. They might just blink. blink. <laughs> yeah, we don't know. No, we know about bewitch, right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 Amen. 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 Wow. Wow. But we got to realize, look, we got to be willing. That's right. Just like God was willing. Everything God did for us, he was willing to do it. Amen. Okay? And he wanted to do it. Yeah. And he loved doing it. Yes. He loves doing it right now, even yeah. though we wicked. Yes. Amen. If it wasn't for Jesus Christ. Okay? And I'm going to put it like this, because I don't want nobody thinking, oh, you know, he, that, 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 that preacher over there, boy, he, 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 he ain't telling them right. I am telling you right. Because, see, we are wicked. Yeah. We were born that way. Say that. Yes. Yeah. That's what the Bible says. I'm just telling you what the Word of God says. We were born wicked. Mm -hmm. That's why Jesus had to come. Mm -hmm. Because we were wicked. Yeah. And even after we accept Jesus Christ, we still living in this flesh, and in this flesh, the Bible says, there dwelleth no good thing. No good thing. Yes, sir. We think evil thoughts. Yep. Yes, sir. Amen. Yeah. Amen. We think evil dreams sometimes. Yeah. I woke up a few times in mine, yeah. hollering. Yeah. My wife said, you was hollering. What was going on? You know what was going on? That old life. Yes, sir. Uh -oh. yeah. What I was doing back there, it was like fresh right here. But I was dreaming until I woke up. Wow. Yes, sir. Amen. Amen. Breathing all hard. Yes, sir. Wow. Amen. But my thoughts were them old thoughts. I was thinking I was back there in them streets again. Uh -oh. uh, yeah. Amen. Doing all kind of stuff. You know, you can't remember everything in the dreams. No. Uh -oh. Amen. Oh, but you know what you was doing was stuff you did before. Oh, way back there. Oh, Amen. Amen. 
See, we need that. We 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 need good stuff. Yeah. And the more we read the word of God, good Amen. stuff come in. Yes, now the flesh is gonna do what the flesh yes, is gonna do That's because right. our minds are carnal. Yes. Okay, we were born carnal minded. Uh -huh. Okay, and we're gonna have the carnal mind until we get changed. Amen. Okay, so we're gonna have that. But Hebrews 13, 16, one more time, then I want to go to one more and I'm done. But to do good, matter of fact, I'm gonna read 15 and then hit 16, then I'll go to the next one. Yes. By him, therefore, let us offer the sacrifice of praise to God. Continually, always be worshiping the Lord. Amen. Amen. Yes, that is the fruit of our lips, mm -hmm. giving thanks to His name. Yes, sir. Yes. Quit lying right. yeah. and start letting praise come out of your yes. mouth. Amen. Amen. Glorify God with your lips yes. and in your language, That's in right. your talk, yes. and in the way you walk. Amen. You have to. Yes, sir. Amen. You have to worship God. Amen. Everybody don't wake up saying, oh, Lord, I thank you for this day. Yeah. Yeah. Everybody don't do that. Yeah. Amen. Amen. Yeah. Amen. I remember when I was working, but I was so occupied with trying to get myself together and get to work. Uh -huh. I didn't say thank you, Lord, until I was on the freeway. Right, right. Amen. I'm driving and this and that, and then all of a sudden, oh, man, Lord, I do. Yeah. Here I go. Right. Amen. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. Amen. Should have did it a long time ago when I was brushing my teeth. Right. Should have yeah. did it a long time ago as soon as my foot hit the floor. Amen. 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 But see, you know what that does? That takes practice. It does. Yes, sir. Yeah. So I'll encourage anybody up in here, practice. Amen. Because practice will make you better and practice will make you good. Amen. 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 The man said to Jesus, good master. He didn't even know Christ like that. That's why Jesus had to come back on him. He, Jesus knew that man didn't know, you know, why he should be calling him good. He knew that man didn't know enough about him. Hey, Amen. Good master. Jesus said, hold it, hold it. Hold it. Why are you calling me good? Amen. Yeah. He was writing what he said. Yeah. Yeah. Okay? Because the little bit that he did see, or the little bit that he did hear, yeah. he knew. Oh, isn't that good? Yeah. Yeah. Amen. He might have even seen a miracle too. Yeah. Yeah. And he realized oh, this man is good. Yeah. Because of who he is, he's good. Yeah. We have to take that attitude. Yeah. Regardless of how much we know about Jesus, we have to realize He is good. Yeah. Yeah. Amen? Yeah. Amen. See, we quick to say God is good all the time. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. But sometimes He ain't. Yeah. And I'm just saying this because we act like He's not. Yeah. Yeah. Amen. Is He? Oh, God is good. All the time. Yeah, all the time. And all the time, God is good. And then we go on. It's just a cliche to us. Right. Yeah. Amen. That's just like saying hi to, to another believer. Yeah. Amen. Right. Amen. But you didn't tell them other people how good when you was at your little family thing. Yeah. Hmm. You wouldn't tell nobody how good God was. Hmm. Amen. Yeah. You wouldn't tell the youngsters how good God was. Yeah. Hmm. Amen. They puff puff pass it. Yeah, they do. <laughs> wow. Amen. Yeah, I mean, we all got people in our family that put up some pads. That's right. That's Amen. right. That's right. Some, some, some people in our family double clutch. Yeah. And they get their little drink out. Amen. Mm -hmm. Yeah. They do that, but you know what? Where are the believers? Right. See, a lot of people in families, the believers, want to be in another room. All right. Amen. Mm. Amen. Yeah. Mm. See, because I don't mind going around the smoke. Amen. Yeah. That's yeah. right. Amen. Yeah. Yeah. Because when I go around the smoke, they already know who I am. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah. So I already know just by me walking over there. Yeah. 
I'm bringing God into the equation. Amen. Yes. 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 Sometimes you don't have to say nothing. Yes. <laughs> because you're representing somebody. Amen. Yeah. So sometimes when you go into a place, yeah. okay, where it don't seem like God is, yeah. you bring God. Yeah. Yeah. If you're a child of God and if you really believe yeah. in what you say, yeah. then wherever your feet touch mm. belongs to God. Amen. God don't understand. Amen. You can change the situation if you want to. If you're willing to change a situation, you can do that. Hallelujah. Amen. 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 Don't be scared. Mm. One of my favorite scriptures, don't be afraid of their faces. Amen. Mm. Amen. You can't afford to be afraid of people's faces. Amen. 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 Because you have something to offer. Yes, you do. Amen. Amen. And you might not get another opportunity to offer it. Mm. That's right. Amen? So you have to do good while you can. Amen? Amen. Just do it while you can. And let me finish this out with 16. But do good and to communicate. Forget not. Don't forget. Yeah. Yeah. Amen? Forget not. For with such sacrifices God is well pleased. Right. See, when you sacrifice some time mm -hmm. on God's behalf, yes. God is pleased with you. Amen. Amen. Yes, he is. Because you're not using all your time for yourself. Amen. Right. God wants us to use Amen. our time to present God to people. Amen. Amen. Even your family. Yes. You know, you 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 know your nephew and your nieces and and, and maybe your youngest sister or brother or whatever. You know they're doing what the world do. Amen. 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 Because my family that do it, I ain't mad at them. Amen. Amen. I tell them, don't hide that. What you hiding it for? Yeah. You know, I don't went so far messing with them. Yeah. Hey, hey. Yeah. I put my, I put my fingers up. And I said, hey. <laughs> Woo! I love it. Amen. Okay, I'm not going to hit it. Amen. But I do it to see what I can get out of them. Right. If I can get a response, if I can, you, you, you know, it's good because they already know who I represent. Amen. Okay. And I'm just coming to make them uncomfortable. I do this stuff on purpose sometimes. Amen. Amen. I want them to understand that I love you enough to make you uncomfortable. Amen. Now, if you keep on, I'm not gonna tell you to stop doing it. No. And then I tell them I used to do it. Yeah. Yep. Okay. So I'm not trying to make you stop doing nothing. I can't do it anyway. Right. But he can. Yeah. Yeah. See, God can. Amen. Amen. Last one. Go to the book of Galatians. Willing to do good. We, we really do have to examine ourselves and make yeah. sure that we, we are willing to do good. Mm -hmm. Galatians chapter 6. Willing to do good. <clears throat> Some of us should be familiar. Amen. Yeah. Amen. Amen. <laughs> Woo, I love God. Well, God brings stuff back out. Let me tell you something. If you don't go to Bible study, Bible study will come to you. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Oh, yeah. Amen. You can't get away. Mm. Stop hiding and just come on out. Amen. Amen. <laughs> Just come on out. You'll be pleased. You know, you'll be glad that you did. Amen. 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 Because the Bible will become more clear huh, say that. to you. That's right. Amen. 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 Galatians chapter 6, looking at the 10th verse. We there? Amen. Amen. It reads as follows. As we have therefore opportunity. Mm -hmm. And we do have opportunity. Mm -hmm. Amen. Amen. We Amen. just don't take advantage of the opportunity. Right. right. Amen. Right. Right. As we have therefore opportunity, let us do good unto all men, unto all people. Yeah. Especially, quit talking about the brother and the sister that you ah. go to church with. Mm. Stop it. Mm. Love everybody. 
Okay, I'm a, the best way to do it, love the person, hate the sin. Amen. Amen. That's the way you got to look at people. Love them as a person, but hate the sin that they do. Yes, sir. Yeah. So if you loving somebody, see, people don't think, oh, I can't get around that because they be sinning this and that. That's because you ain't got no love in your heart. Oh, yeah. See, because love will make you do some things that you normally won't do. Amen. And I'm speaking from experience. Yes, Amen. Hey Amen. I love a lot of people that mm, I really don't want to, but you know what? I have to. Yes, sir. Amen. Amen. See, that's the difference. When you sell out for Christ, you take on that Christ-like love. Yes, sir. Yeah. They killed him and he loved him anyway. Yeah. I ain't had nobody to kill me and had to love him. But the world was trying to kill him. And then eventually he allowed them to kill him. But you know what? Father forgive them. For they know not what they do. They are ignorant people. Yeah. Wow. And sometimes we're ignorant. We think we know about somebody's life, but you don't really know a lot about their life. Right. You know, if you're just going to church with them, you don't know nothing. Yeah. If you're not calling them and talking to them and, and just having regular conversations with somebody, okay, and every time you talk to somebody, you don't have to start off with God, just you calling to see how they're doing, and you just start talking to them. Yeah. Then you find out what's going on with them. Then the God factor pops up. Yes, sir. You don't have to make it pop up. It pops up anyway. Okay. Why? Because the God factor is in you. Amen. And if the God factor is in you, yes. the God factor got to come out. Yes. And if the God factor come out, then the person that you're talking to is going to have to listen to the God factor that's in you. That's why. You don't have to worry about forcing the word out your body. The word finds a way. Hallelujah. That's just the bottom line. You ain't got to worry about that. As we therefore, as we have therefore opportunity, let us do good unto all men, especially unto them who are of the household of faith, who is your brother and sister in Christ. The last thing you want to do is to treat them bad. Because if we say we love God, who we can't see, and we hate our brothers and our sisters that we can see, we are told up. We are liars. Amen. That's what scripture say. We are liars. Okay? And the truth is not in, is not in us. Amen. So we shouting hallelujah, and when we shouting hallelujah, you don't believe what you shouting. Mm. You a lie. That's why we have to practice what we preach. Yeah. Practice what we study. Right. Amen. Amen. Yeah. We have to do all that. Now we had a, in closing, we had a nice little prayer thing going on today, right? Yes, sir. Yeah. We also had a nice little prayer thing last week, right? Amen. Yeah. That means God is talking. Amen. Amen. Okay? He's talking to us. He is. Amen? And he's doing those things because he loves us. Amen. And he's doing those things because he is good. Amen. We have to learn how to be good. Hallelujah. Amen. Instead of cussing somebody out. Amen. Amen. Speak the word to them. Amen. 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 Yes, sir. Amen. Instead of calling somebody the B word. Wow. Say, you blessed. Uh, <laughs> you ain't got to cuss people out. Amen. Okay. Instead of saying, mm, you. Huh. Okay? Say forgive you. Yeah, 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 yeah. Amen. 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 See, you have to learn how to use your words. Amen. Amen. You ain't got to cuss people out. 
Somebody cut you off, here you go. See, bad drivers get a bad rap. Yes, sir. <laughs> See, people want to cuss bad drivers out. <laughs> because they drive like it's only them on the road. They don't care nothing about you. They don't care nothing about putting on the blinker. They don't care about nothing being two lanes over from the from, from, from the exit lane. They'll just shoot right on over and they go on about their business. They ain't putting no blinkers on. They don't care if they cut right in front of you. Okay, don't you see me coming? <laughs> Instead of cussing them out, just just you know, Lord, touch them. <laughs> touch them, Lord. Amen. Amen. Because as soon as you give in to all that stuff, guess what? Your peace is gone. Yep. Amen. See, that's what happens. See, you giving away your peace when you don't have to. When they're driving crazy like that, you just go ahead and say, Lord, touch them. Amen. And you can say it in a whole different tone. Lord, touch them. It don't have to be in a nice way. Okay. Because you're already mad, amen. amen. You just want God to touch them. So if you just got to put a little anger stuff in your voice, uh -huh. then that's what you do. But it's better than you cussing all over the place and losing your peace. Amen. amen. Because what happens is you're going to be watching them until they out of your sight. You're going to be, they done did that, you're going to be watching that same car. You know, right over there, you're going to <laughs> hey, yeah, 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 yeah. Why are you passing? Amen. 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 Praise the Lord. <laughs> but we have to be willing. We have to be willing to do good. And the only way we can do it is in the Word and letting the Holy Spirit lead us and guide us in all the truth. Amen. Thy word is truth. God's word is the truth. Amen. Let's give God a hand.